Good morning, Jupiter High School. I'm Sam Shaver. And I'm Katherine Fox, and we're here with your news from Monday, October 9th, 2017. Class news. ELL students can receive math tutoring in room 6106 on Wednesday after school till 3.30. Uh -huh. Junior class rings. Herf Jones will be on campus today and tomorrow during lunch for all of your class ring questions and to take your orders. The PSAT is on Wednesday for all 9th and 10th grade students and registered juniors. Resources to prepare for the PSAT and waivers to opt out can be found in guidance and on Edline. The district's college and career fair will be held at the South Florida Fairgrounds on Wednesday, October 18th from 6 to 8 p.m. Over 150 colleges, universities, career programs, and military representatives will be present as well as commercial vendors who provide tutoring and college search services. Additionally, information sessions titled How to Start Your FAFSA will be held every 15 minutes. All high school students and their parents and guardians are invited to attend this event free of charge. Clubs, the Forgotten Soldier Outreach Club, meets today in room 6105 after school. Find out how you can earn community service hours and make a difference in the lives of those serving abroad. Host of members, there will be a meeting on Wednesday, October 18th after school in the auditorium. We will discuss regional competition, community service opportunities, and fundraising. Please plan on attending. Remember to fulfill your lunch duty commitment. Thanks and see you then. Interact Club. Attention all interactors and potential members. There is a meeting today in the cafeteria after school. Important info regarding the rescheduled beach cleanup, haunted Halloween walk, and Thanksgiving food drive will be discussed. Snacks will be provided for meeting attendees. Your attendance is crucial. The leaders of Tomorrow Society are selling delicious gourmet popcorn throughout the campus to help benefit JHS care team. Nothing is butter than a bag of gourmet popcorn, so oh, get yours today. That is so punny. You are also invited to their meeting today at 245 in Miss Garcia's room 4110. If you are interested in making a difference, come check us out. Pause for a Cause is holding a supply drive today through Friday, October 13th. We are in need of towels, sheets, blankets, pedigree small bites, dog food, garbage bags, dog collars, and dog or cat toys. Please bring the supplies to room 5113 and you will get hours for those donations. Thank you. The NHS induction ceremony will take place Wednesday, October 11th. Students must arrive by 5.15 p.m. in the proper attire. There is a mandatory rehearsal right after school today in the auditorium. Attendance is required at both events to be inducted into the National Honor Society. Here's one last look at the Ceramics Club commercial. Jupiter Religious Coalition, there will be a JRC meeting immediately after school on Wednesday, October 11th in Ms. Plagman's room, 7113. The club's mission is to bring increased awareness to all different religions of the world, as well as tolerance towards others. The Robotics Club will meet on Wednesday, October 11th at 7 p.m. Details about the location are available on the flyer you can get from Mr. Zakahara's room, 3101. Interested in helping plan our dance marathon, betting the children... Benefiting the Children's Miracle Network? If so, interviews will be conducted on Tuesday, October 10th, after school in Mr. Hammett's Portable One. With your help, we will have another successful year and help the children of Shands Hospital. The Red Cross Club is looking for new members. Please stop by room 5106 during periods 1 through 5th and 4103 during period 6 to help this club and help those in need of crisis situations. Debbie's Dream Club is holding their first fundraiser today from 5 to 9 p.m. at Chipotle. Please let them know you are with Debbie's Dream Club and 50% of your purchase will go towards the foundation. We hope to see all of you there. Global Business and Finance Club will be meet October 12th at 3 p.m. in Portable 11. Students interested in the stock market should attend. We will have a guest speaker in finance and business. Sports. Girls Lacrosse, there is a very important meeting for all past, present, and future girls lacrosse players today at 3 p.m. in room 10106. Athletic Director Steve Canning will be running the meeting. Stay tuned for SGA News and have a magical Monday, Warriors! <laughs> my, my. Oh, hey, Jupe Nation! Sorry, didn't see you there. We're here with another exciting segment of SGA News. I'm Emily Evans. And I'm Nat the Song. 
I've been announcing this every week, but here it goes again. Don't forget to make suggestions so we can help your high school years only get better. You can make such a request by filling out a slip of paper in room 4217, the media center, and the guidance office. Students, your teachers do so much for you, so don't forget to recognize them by nominating your favorite teachers for Teacher of the Week. It's a piece of cake. All you have to do is fill out a form that are on top of the Teacher of the Week boxes, then turn it into that same box. They're located in room 4217, Guidance, and Student Services. Also, this week's Athlete of the Week is Demetrius Brown. Demetrius is in 11th grade and a player on the basketball team. He works hard to maintain good grades while playing basketball and being an active member of the SWAT club. Congratulations on being this week's Athlete of the Week. Student government is hosting a Halloween costume drive on Oct until October 13th. If you have any costumes that you no longer use at home, bring them in. The costumes will go to families at El Sol. You can drop these costumes off in room 4217. Thank you. Now to Nat. <laughs> Students, SGA will be holding a voters registration sign up in the courtyard on October 10th, 11th and 12th. You must be at least 16 to pre-register. Please sign up so you can vote and represent our country and don't forget your driver's license or a photo ID to register. SGA is still selling Pura Vita bracelets for $5 a pop. There are not many left. If you would like to purchase one, please go to room 4217 in the mornings. These bracelets can help you show your support for our ocean and all the fishies that live in it. All right, so homecoming is just around the corner. It's the week of October 30th till November 4th. There will also be a homecoming parade on November 2nd at 4 p.m. The parade starts at Jupiter Lanes and goes down the Tony Pena Road. If you and your club would like to be in the parade, Please fill out a form in the SGA room for 217. 4217. <laughs> All homecoming parade forms are due by October 5th. Student government is also hosting the homecoming carnival on November 2nd from 6 to 8 p.m. in the courtyard here on campus. Come introduce your club to the rest of our school by filling out an application found in the room 4217. These applications are due by Friday, October 19th. Dress days will be lit. Also, if you want to be transported into New York City for one night and for only $20, then you should go to the homecoming dance. You get these tickets at the homecoming ticket sales table. Tickets sales will be starting on Monday, October 16th for $15 for seniors only. But other students can get their tickets from October 17th through November 2nd for $20. The last day of ticket sales will be on Friday, November 3rd for $25. Make sure to have your student ID, contract, and money. You can find contracts in Guidance, Student Services, Room 4217, and Edline. See you next time, Jupiter High!